using my dead friend's tired ass movie quotes, with my dead friend's alias, and my dead friend's family, in a house that must have been paid for with my dead friend's stashed millions? Wow, that's a real mind fuck. Yeah, I'll show you a fucking mind fuck. I'm gonna stick my boy in your eye, it's gonna come out of your ear, huh? I, I, I didn't mean any can buy that, P. Trevor? Lube up your eye hole, fucker! Cause I'm gonna fuck your tiny mind, huh? I'm about ready to turn you into roadkill! Uh, please! Don't turn me into anything! I just wanna be Wade! Are we nearly there yet? No, Wade! Are we nearly, nearly there? You keep this up, you're not gonna get there at all! Can you tell me a story? No, Wade! Let's play a game then! You know animal, mineral, or vegetable? I'll go first! I'm nanotechnology. Uh, you're what? Ooh, damn it. I gave it away. I wasn't, I wasn't supposed to say what I am. I'll start again. Animal, vegetable, or mineral. Hey, 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 how about this? I'll tell you a story if you promise never to speak again. I like stories. Of course you do. This story's about a boy called... Trevor! A boy called Tri... Tri... Uh, Trisha. Is Trisha a boy's name? It doesn't matter. Kind of weird. He was weird. He was the smartest, toughest, weirdest kid in Canada. Well, in the Canadian border region of America. Okay. This boy, he had all the talent, charisma, and guile that a boy could have. But he didn't know what to do with it. He should become a baseball player. No, he shouldn't. Because he's not a fucking sellout idiot. Or hockey player. He did for a while, but his coach accidentally had a stick jammed up his ass. What could he do? I'll tell you in a second, okay? Just let me concentrate on the road. But Trevor! That's it. That giant sprawl. Los Santos. This is the place! I seen it on the holiday card. So, this is Los Santos. I guess it is. I always wanted to come here. But you got stuck in the desert? It's still San Andreas. Best part of the state. This is where dead men come back to life. Huh? It's been nearly ten years. Oh, but you'll keep for another day or so, huh, old friend? You mother fucking fuck! I grieved for you! You weren't even fucking dead. You were my best friend. Well, guess who's coming to shit on your doorstep, you fuck! Los Santos, the city of shitheads. Where else would he be? Floyd's over in Vespucci Beach. Will you tell me the story about that boy, Trisha? Ah, yeah, yeah. Where were we? You were saying what he could do. He, he couldn't throw, and his coach had a had a stick accident like, like I had one. Right, right. But he could fly planes, this kid. So he signed up to the Air Force to fly all day long and bomb villages and maybe just maybe drop the nuke. And it was all going well until one day, just before he got his wings, an evil witch in charge of psychological evaluations told him he was unstable. Grounded him for life. That's terrible. It was. Sent him to a deep pit of doubt and despair. And just then, ju just as he hit rock bottom, he met a fat, silver-tongued troll under a bridge. That's cool. What was the troll's name? Mike. Michelle. A lady troll? Yeah, he had tits like one, but no, no, he, he was a boy. Michelle is a funny name for a boy. Well, this was a funny boy. He sat under his bridge, robbing anyone who passed him by. Sometimes, 
He'd go into town and rob the shops and inns and such. Then he persuaded our hero that maybe he should rob people too. And you know what? Little Trisha did rob people. And little Trisha was good at it. And they lived happily ever after? For a while. Until the troll met another troll in a strip club. Oh, oh, we're near Floyd Castle. I've seen it on I Find Maps. I'll give you directions. Now, keep going. You don't turn here. It's a rag up here. It's straight here. This is the place, I think it is at least. Cousin Floyd! It's up here, Trevor! Floyd, it's me, Wade! Who? Me, Wade, your cousin! Who? Your cousin! Fuck! He's come to visit you, you rude fuck! Now get up off the floor and fix me a fucking drink! Oh, you, Wade! <laughs> I heard you was off smoking meth somewhere. No, not somewhere here! He's gonna smoke meth here! Give me a fucking lighter! You can't smoke here! Okay. <laughs> this is my girlfriend's place. She's at a business conference. You can't smoke here and you can't stay here. How's it going, cousin? It's been a while. Yeah, I ain't seen you since you was caught in Evelyn's bed. A guy was never approved. You gotta go. Both of you. My girlfriend? She'd kill me if she knew I had guests. Well, it's not much of a girlfriend if she don't like your family. Now, would you get me a fucking drink? I'm not gonna ask you again. Oh, yeah. Okay. Wait. Uh... I ain't got no booze. Well, then you go out and fucking get me something. You go too. Citizens arrest! Kind of. Hello there! He saw the error of his ways. Who says chivalry? I only wish more people were like you today.